Top 10 largest nuclear explosions in the world you may not know. There are always some epic explosions in action movies. However, in fact, there are many different types of explosives, and in them, there are terrible types than the ones we often see in movies. Together with Toki Book, Top 10 Amazing lists the largest nuclear explosions in the world. 1. Tsar Bama The hydrogen aerial bomb made in the Soviet Union had an explosive yield of 50 megatons, equivalent to 50 million tons of TNT. More powerful than the 3,800 bombs dropped on Hiroshima during World War II and is the largest atomic bomb ever built and detonated. On October 30, 1961, the Soviet Union detonated at an altitude of 4,000 meters on an island in the Arctic Circle called Novaya Zemla. The bomb was carried by plane. Hydrogen bomb is a bomb that uses hydrogen nuclear fusion, which is many times more destructive than an atomic bomb. This kind of weapon have explosive equivalents of hundreds of kilotons, and when there are three stages of explosion, the weapon's destructive power increases many times over. In fact, the bomb originally wanted by Prime Minister Nikita Khrushchev had the equivalent of 100 megatons, but the researchers found that such equipment would produce dangerous emissions that would pollute areas far from the test site. The new bomb reduces emissions by up to 97%. According to the Nuclear Weapons Archive, the bomb's design is nothing new in terms of technology. It uses a thermonuclear explosion to trigger another larger explosion, a process that creates a chain of explosions. SAR bomb testing was conducted when the United States was trying to create a thermonuclear weapon that tested in the Pacific Ocean in 1954. Castle Bravo was a code of America's most powerful hydrogen bomb, one third of the explosive power of SAR bomb. 2. Novaya Zemla 219 the 219 bomb test at Novaya Zemla of the Soviet Union had explosive yield up to 24.2 megatons, and this was also the second most powerful bomb in history detonated by this country. The explosion had the power to destroy everything in an area of nearly 10 square kilometers, causing third degree burns in areas within 5,827 square kilometers. Test 219 was a nuclear test conducted by the Soviet Union in the atmosphere via an ICBM. Testing was carried out on 24 December 1962 in the Novaya Zemla test range. It is a thermonuclear bomb with a mass of about 24.2 megatons and a destructive radius of about 6 miles, making it the second largest thermonuclear explosion in history after the Tsar Bomba. 3. Nova Zembla 173, 174, and 147 In all three Soviet bomb tests, 173, 174, and 147 all took place in Nova Zembla, with the destructive power of all three being 21 megatons, about 1,000 times more than the explosion at Nagasaki, Japan. They are respectively the third, fourth, and fifth most powerful nuclear explosions in human history. A bomb like this could destroy everything in the 7.8 km square area. 4. Novaya Zemla 25 The Novaya Zemla explosion over 25 was carried out by the Soviet Union in April 1962 with a destructive power up to 19.1 megatons. Currently, images of the explosion are still being kept under wraps. However, some people believe that with such destructive power, the explosion can destroy everything within 7 km squared and cause third degree burns in an area with a radius of 5,200 km squared. 5. Castle Bravo Explosion Castle Bravo was detonated exactly on August 28, 1954, where it is considered the most destructive bomb in Castle campaign of testing nuclear explosions. At first, this bomb was estimated to have only 6 megatons, but eventually its explosive power reached 15 megatons, forming a mushroom-shaped mass up to 35 kilometers high. This is also a terrible mistake in the calculation of the U.S. explosion. The damage made 665 people around the Marshall Islands heavily radioactive. 6. Castle Yankee Explosion the Castle Yankee bomb was detonated on May 4, 1954, and was also the second largest U.S. explosion in the Castle campaign, with a yield of 13.5 megatons. Its fallout spread as far as Mexico, which is about more than 11,000 kilometers from the test site in just four days. With such destructive power, this explosion can cause third-degree burns in an area with a radius of about 4,500 kilometers squared. 7. Novaya Zembla 123 the Soviet Union conducted explosion test number 123 Novaya Zemla with an explosive yield of 12.5 megatons. There is currently no specific video of this explosion. However, with such destructive power, this explosion can destroy everything in an area 5.5 km squared and cause third degree burns in an area with a radius of about 3,400 km squared. 8. Castle Romeo Explosion Castle Romeo is a hydrogen bomb experiment at Operation Castle in 1954. The bomb's yield was determined to be 11 megatons. Instead of testing on the island, Castle Romeo was detonated right above the sea at Bikini Atoll Reef. The explosion burned everything within a radius of about 5 kilometers. 9. Ivy Mike Explosion 
The Ivy Mike explosion was the first test of the hydrogen bomb with an explosive yield about 700 times greater than the first atomic bomb that the United States dropped in Hiroshima. The explosion was determined to be 10.2 megatons, destroying much of Eulogy Lab Island, creating a crater 50 meters deep and a mushroom cloud up to 42 kilometers high. 10. Novia Zembla 158 and 168 on August 25, 1962, the Soviet Union conducted its 158th nuclear test and its 168th nuclear test on September 19, 1962, both times taking place at the Novaya Zemlya Regional Test Site in the Northern Soviet Union close to North Korea. Each of these two tests had explosive force determined to be closing to 10 megatons, burning everything in an area about 4.6 square kilometers and causing third-degree burns in an area of 2,800 square kilometers. There are currently no photos or video footage of the test. Nuclear weapons have tremendous destructive power, lasting effects and beyond human control, which is why governments around the world are still trying to control and limit them. But if used properly and for peaceful purposes, nuclear energy can be an inaccessible alternative.